A serious overnight fire in Plainville leaving a number of people hurt, including some firefighters. It was all part of a very busy shift for the department. News H. Jeff Vallon has details. I thought, oh, they're working on the street. You know, they usually do over here. What Dorothy Griffin of Plainville actually was hearing early Monday morning was firefighters across the street. The porch was in flames, uh, was engulfed in flames, and everybody was here. Trying to help the man and woman who live at 7 Washington Street. When we arrived, we had heavy fire on the first floor, uh, one person outside the building and one person inside the building. The woman was taken to New Britain General Hospital with smoke inhalation. Firefighters had to rescue the man inside. A very pleasant retiree, says his neighbor. Yesterday I saw him. Things are fine, went to bed, woke up to this, so I don't know. We do know he was taken to Bridgeport to be treated for burns, but not how severe. Also still unclear what caused the fire, though the neighbor is ruling one factor out. There wasn't any lightning. The storm had passed, so, you know, I don't think it was lightning. Though lightning strikes are being blamed for two other house fires in Plainville just hours earlier. Oh, this is our third fire today. We've had two other structure fires. And this is our third one, so uh, our guys are pretty whooped right now, and the heat's not add, is adding to it. With the story from Plainville, Jeff Vallon, News 8. One of those firefighters needed treatment for smoke inhalation at New Britain General Hospital, but he has since been released.